you guys, this is Shaw Kirby 77 and welcome back to Mario Kart Wii. In the last part we finished time trials and today we are going to start mirror mode. Which to me is can be hectic and I don't know what character I got last time. Oh, I believe we had Toadette. So let's be Toadette for in this episode. And wow, we're almost done with Mario Kart Wii, only about 8 more parts left. Alright, so let's start with Mushroom Cup. On mirror mode. And from what I heard, mirror mode is hectic. Like, to me, it is. I mean, it's more hectic than 150cc. And I, as you can see, everything's all flipped. Including the letters, they're flipped because it's mirror. So if you're... Imagine playing this game uh, through the mirror. If you're looking at a mirror while playing this game, it'll pretty much be the normal mode. But if you're um, playing the normal mode and watching the mirror, you pretty much have this. Except, you know, the first place icon will be on the right side. But yeah. I kind of like mirror mode. And sometimes I do screw up because I always get um, mistaken for another route. But overall, it's not that bad. But I prefer 150cc. Just well because I like 150cc. I mean, I wouldn't mind playing 100 or er, mirror mode. I do like mirror mode though, because I think it's more crazier than 150cc. But overall, it's not that bad. It's pretty much the same thing as 150cc, except it just flipped. But yeah. So anyway, guys, um, probably the time I post this video is, is probably like a week after Christmas, and uh, I just want to say how how was your guys' Christmas? good. I got a few things. I got Scour Sword. I'm like, yay, I got Scour Sword. I'm so happy. And I also got Kirby's Return to Dreamland. That's really awesome. I love that game. And Scour Sword. And now I'm Scour Sword. I'm um, going for the first flame. So yeah, going for the first sacred flame. So that's really awesome. And then Kirby, I'm in uh, World 4 with the snowy area. And me and my sister, we got Mario Party 8. Oh my god. Um, in Mario Party 8, there is this extra zone area, and I bought a minigame from for the extra zone. I bought Moped Mayhem, so I was just, uh, you know, I decided to buy that game because it looks really fun. And oh my god, I swear, that minigame makes me laugh. I don't know why. Just the way all the characters move and how they turn, it's just so funny to me. I don't know why. It's just really funny. Yeah, it's I don't know why I crack up every time I play that mini game. Like I play all the levels in Moped Mayhem, and oh my god, that that mini game just cracks me up. I don't know why, but it does. Like I cannot stop laughing when I ever whenever I play that mini game. But yeah, it, it cracks me up. Uh, what else I got for Christmas? I got a couple of Nintendo shirts. I got two Yoshi shirts. Uh, one is purple that says. Um, love Yoshi, because I do love Yoshi, he's so cute, I love Yoshi, and I got another Yoshi shirt that just says Yoshi on it, with a picture of Yoshi, it's a green shirt, and I have a Mario shirt which has Mario and his name on it, so I'm like, yay, I still wish I had like a Zelda shirt, I need a Zelda shirt, my sister did tell me that she did see a Twilight Princess shirt, I'm like, oh my god, I love Twilight Princess, I love Twilight Princess, that's my favorite Zelda game. But, eh, it was like after Christmas that she saw the Twilight Princess shirt. I'm like, boo. And I did see a Zelda shirt in one of the stores, but, but which was a Triforce shirt. But still, I wouldn't mind having a Triforce shirt. I mean, it means that I like Zelda games. I'm a big fan of Zelda. But yeah. Uh, what else did I get? I got Wii Motion Plus. I didn't get the Gold Wii Remote, which was for the Skyward Sword. I only got the... CD, that's it. I didn't get the gold remote, the bundle pack. But still, I'm glad that I have the um, CD because when I listen to the CD, oh my god, I love the Twilight Princess um, medley and the Great Fairy song. Those two are my favorite songs in that CD. I love them. Of course, I love Twilight Princess medley because I love, I love the music in Twilight Princess. I still wish they had like Minna's Lament and that's. Did someone just threw a box? Wow, somebody just got lucky there. But yeah, I wish they had Minda's Lament in part of the Twilight Princess medley. That would be really awesome. But, 
I'm still glad I had the Great Fairy theme because I love the Great Fairy theme. It's probably the most prettiest song. Alright. There we go. Um, I don't know what else I got for Christmas. I can't really think. <laughs> oh, I got a couple of Sawyer stuff. My friend, they came over the, on Christmas Eve. And one of my friends gave me a Sawyer t-shirt with Death the Kid on it. It's a really awesome shirt. And my other friend, oh, and she, my, that friend almost, almost also gave me a, a, a drawing of Soul Maka with a quote from, from the show. It's a really awesome picture. And my other friend, she also knows that I love Soul Eater, and she loves it too. I introduced her to the Soul Eater and she loved it. But anyways, uh, she gave me a Soul Eater necklace that has, uh, it's, just, it's um, Soul Soul um, necklace. It's a really cool necklace, I like it. I'm wearing it right now. And that's pretty much it. My middle sister, she got a lot of it. Uh, I don't know, she got like a lot more Nintendo stuff than me. It's not video games. But she has like a blue, a light blue Yoshi plush. It's really cute. It's just, it's just a light blue Yoshi city now. It's really cute. And she has two Mario shirts. She has one shirt with all Mario characters, including the enemies. And then a um, Mario shirt that has three pipes and one of them has a piranha plant and Mario's standing in one of the pipes and then it says choose wisely don't choose a piranha plant pipe choose like the one that has no piranha plant in it and I thought it was kind of funny oh come on really really game really and she also has this new Super Mario Bros. Wii puzzle it's 550 pieces and we completed it and like um the next day um uh, on the 26th it's a really big puzzle, for surprisingly. It was really huge. It's just like half of my living room's table. It's like a really small table, but it's really long. But it completes like half of it. I'm like, wow, this is a really big, huge puzzle. It was kind of complicated, too, because um, like the bottom of the puzzle is red. And like the corner of the puzzle is like red in the bottom. So it was kind of hard trying to find which pieces go to which. Because they're all pretty much the same color. And on the top of the puzzle is the sky. And it's you know, pretty much blue. So we're trying to find out which piece goes where for the sky. So we were kind of getting lost in that one. But the rest was fine. Like trying to piece up Mario's body together and Yoshi's and all that. that were, those were easy. But the rest was kind of pretty much hard. <laughs> well, it was a fun puzzle. I wouldn't mind doing it again. But right now it's still laying in our living room table. Yeah, it's a really fun puzzle. I want to do it again, actually. But yeah, overall, it was a pretty decent Christmas. Yeah. I enjoyed it. And I've been playing Skyward Sword non-stop, man. I go like for what, three hours, four hours of Skyward Sword. Last night I just finished the Lene... The Lene Lene reminding faculty. I finished that. I gotta tell you, that was a really huge temple. And they did have some troubles here and there, but overall, I uh, was pretty alright. I got the help from my sisters. My sisters were watching me play the game. And they were they were a big help. Because I was kind of puzzled in some of the rooms. Dang it, I missed. Don't take my box! Ugh, I didn't get that box. Great. Well, leave Mario through the red shell backwards. That's good. Uh, I don't know what else to talk about, but besides Christmas, um, I don't know. I can't really think of anything. But I'm almost done with this um, play, so yeah. I don't, I don't really have much to talk about, so I'm not gonna start any topic now because we're almost to the end. Well, I can say yeah. I've been playing. Kirby and Skyward Sword and all stuff, and Mario Party 8. And I actually want to play both Pen Mayhem now. I love that new game. <laughs> that cracked me up. Alright, we played the Mushroom Cup with the perfect score, again, of course. And I got squished. Great. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got. Alright, skip the ending. And G run. Nine minutes. Wow. For ten minutes. Three stars. Yay! Not bad for the first cup of mushroom or first cup of mirror milk. All 
way we didn't get any new characters. But I think we're going to stop here, guys. So in the next part, we will start on Flower Cup of Mirror Mode. So this is Shadow Kirby 77 saying bye.